if you want to download and install the Crackers with this one, Bedrock Port Translated add-on, then make sure you go and watch this video until the end. Perfect. First, you would need to have Minecraft Bedrock updated on your Windows PC or on your Android phone. Open the Microsoft Store on your PC. Search in the search bar Minecraft. Type in it right. And then go and click on the first search result. Scroll down until you see Minecraft for Windows. Click on it. And then here, click on update here if it says update. On the Android, you go to the Google Play Store. Like right here. Search it up. Go to the search bar at the bottom. The right here, you can see. Click on that search bar. Type in Minecraft. And then the one with the Minecraft, dream it, build it, that's the real one. Click on that and hit on update if it says update here, okay? Second, if you don't have the Crackers with Storm Bedrock Port add-on already in your Minecraft game, make sure you guys click on this info card right now because it's needed for this translation pack to work. Now on whatever browser you have, you type in the search bar right here, decaydteam.com. And then once you're in decaydteam.com, you go and click on community add-ons. Click on the community add-ons. You scroll down until you see translated right here. This might change in the future. The locations might change in the future. But just find CWSMBP translated. Hit on download. Once you're here, you scroll down this page until you see the big blue download button. Okay, this is not a media fire link yet, but here you go. It's a media fire link. And then you just hit the big blue download button in this page in Mediafire. And then you just save it to wherever you want, okay? I save it in my downloads folder. That's what we do in this channel, okay? Give this video a like. So how do you freaking install it? Well, you just open up your file explorer. And then you go to your whatever, you, wherever you stored the, the file. Go to my downloads because this is where I stored it. And then... CWSMBP translated is right here. So what you just need to do is right click on this file. Once you right click, you hit on open with. Choose another app. And then choose Minecraft. And then just once. If you only want to open this MC add-on just once. Okay? Not all MC add-ons will open in Minecraft though. But if you want all MC add-ons to open in Minecraft, you hit always. So I'll do always. But if it's already a grass icon, you can only just double click and then it'll automatically launch Minecraft. Okay, so it says import started. Again, this is Minecraft Bedrock though, but like, yeah, there you go. Successfully imported, we have imported. It's back, yes, let's go. On the mobile, you use whatever browser you want. I'm gonna be using Hola browser, okay? So you just type in the URL thingy. Okay, decay-team.com. Just type it like that. And then you'll be put on the website right here, okay? So there you go. You just go and scroll down until you see community add-ons. Click on the picture as always, guys. That's what we do in here, okay? So click on the pictures. So yeah, just click on the picture right here, community add-ons. And just scroll down until you see translate. What happened to my voice? But yeah, translated. There you go. So once you're here, you just click on download. So you click on download right there. And then you scroll down like this. And then after that, after that, you'll hit the blue big download link button. I don't know. Link, big blue link button. And now in Mediafire, you hit that little mini download icon right here. And then there you go. You'll be downloading it right now. Okay. So just you wait. Okay. Whatever. Hold up. And then, yeah, hit on download right here, you know? You just use WLAN now. I don't know what you mean by that, but like, I already know. But, but yeah, WLAN, okay? Your download completed. There you go. Well, how do you install it? Well, you go to your Play Store because that is your friend. You go there in the Google Play Store. You go click on the, the search icon. You go to the top, to the search bar. Type in File Manager Plus. And you hit file manager by file manager plus click on that click on install but once it finishes downloading you hit on open it's gonna ask you some questions but that's all right it's easy click next next and then make this green blue whatever allow access to manage all files allow file manager plus to send you notifications yes very easy questions right there you go once you're in this page you go to where you download 
Oh, you go to where you stored that file. I stored it in my downloads folder because that's where pretty much everything gets stored. And then I go to browser. But for you, it's different, okay? Because I use Hola browser, so like it's gonna be different for you guys if you use a different browser too. Might have a folder as well, like mine. But here you go. Once you find a file, what you can do is just click on it. You don't even need to rename it anymore. Just hit Minecraft. Just once if you only want this MC add-on file to be opened in Minecraft. Just once. But if you want all MC add-ons to be opened in Minecraft, you hit always. Okay, import started, it says. So, there you go. Successfully imported, guys. Very nice. So, we've installed it properly on Windows and on Android. Nice. But how the heck do we play this thing? Well, first, if you already have, if, if you've seen in the website, right? If you've seen the website that the language that you want it to be translated from English to whatever language is in here, you're good to go. You just need to go to Minecraft, go to settings, and then just go to language right here. And then choose the language that you have that is supported here and pick it here in minecraft if that makes sense so let's say russia russian language is available here right you can see right here go to minecraft and then you pick russian right here okay i think you already know how to do it like if you know russian language and then there you go you've successfully changed your language and then what you need to do is go back and then hit on play uh after that you create new create new world it's the same with the other language too. So, there you go. Create your world. Now go to your resource packs settings or option, whatever tab. And then what you can do is click on owned. And then after that, you find Crackers with the Storm Bedrock port right here. So you activate it with this activate button. And you also activate the translated pack. There you go. Activate that. Go to the active tab right here. Make sure Crackers with a Storm Bedrock Port Translated is on top. The pack is on top of CWSM Bedrock Port, the main add-on. You click on the settings for Bedrock Port if you want it to have normal skybox or different. And then what you can do is now go to Behavior Packs. You're good with Resource Packs. And now what you can do is just find the Bedrock Port main add-on, activate it, and activate the Translated Pack as well here. And then if it says Missing Dependencies, you just allow it. You just import it regardless and as always crackers with the storm battle port translated is on top of the main add-on and here you click on settings right in the translated pack and then whatever language you've chosen there in the minecraft settings you slide it here so since we put russian earlier when we changed the language from english to this language russian we put we, we slide it to the right so it's russian so the numbers might change in the future. Maybe there's more languages here. You know, we need to have Tagalog. So people living in the Philippines that are watching this. Yeah, make sure you guys, you know, contribute. And yeah, awesome job by Hele Killer too. And this person for, you know, making this translated pack come to life. But yeah, you just choose the language that you've chosen earlier in the Minecraft settings. So yeah, there you go. And then hit on the X. Also, if you go to the Crackers with this one, Bedrock Port Behavior Pack settings right here. You can go in, set it to only spawn for like in a normal world, but if you go to the left, it's only spawning for a flat world, which means probably it's going to be optimized for a flat world, but if you go to the right, it's optimized for a normal world, so that's up to your preference. So you hit on X once you're done with that. So now you just go to experiments right here at the very bottom left, scroll down here on the right, and then under add-on creators, you enable upcoming creator features. So just enable add-on creator features or this upcoming creators features thingy toggle anyway after that click on the create a button and then create anyway of course why wouldn't minecraft want you to create a world you paid for this game so there you go there's a chat right there at the top left and then once you go to your inventory you go to the nature tab scroll down to your mob X section you'll see the spawn eggs are translated and if you spawn the wither storm i didn't receive the structure that is weird but if you go to zero zero you will probably find it so let's go to zero zero if not you already know what to do if you don't find the structure you just recreate the world over and over again until you find the house structure for me though it seems like it did not spawn 
So that is very weird. But regardless, we have crackers with some better port translated. So when we summon Wither Storm right here, with this command, there you go. We have the commanded Wither and the text in the boss bar or at the boss bar is translated from English to whatever language you've chosen, okay? But for me, it's Russian right here. But yeah, guys, if this video did help you out, make sure you guys go like it, subscribe, you know, and share this video so more people can download this translation, translated pack. And that's going to be awesome so more people will be uh, getting access and actually will enjoy more of Crackers with the Stone Battle Report because it's in their native language. And if you guys want to just join my Discord server, it's in the description. If you want any help, you can go there as well. And also, follow my Instagram. It's going to be in the description as well. All my links are in the description. And that's pretty much it. I hope you guys stay safe. I'll pray to the most high. And I'll see you guys in the next video. If you want to watch a new video from me or another video from me, just click on this info card right now.